Hey guys, and welcome back to Prey, which actually I think might be the final episode. In the last episode, well, these guys made Tommy a salty boy. So uh, we are, well, we have been exacting our vengeance on these poor, pitiful creatures, and we're going to continue to do so. Keeper! Well, uh, show yourself! Yes. Oh, that's cool. That looks really cool. I guess we're going to see the keeper. Hey, buddy. Human? Why are you here? I am here to avenge my people. Your people? Ooh. Were it not for us, your species would never have existed. You were created only to be consumed. What are you saying? Eons ago, your planet was nothing but a barren rock. We seeded your world as we have a thousand others with the beginnings of organic life. Returning to reap our harvest when that life had ripened. We own you. I am a warrior of the Cherokee Nation. Nobody owns nice. me. Cherokee? I do not understand this notion. Your spirit is what separates you from the others. It is why you have been spared. We will add your strength and knowledge to ours. You will become like us. You will become a god. I came here only to kill you. Your skills are formidable, but they are no match for the power of the Keeper. We shall see. You will fail. And we will harvest your planet. It is over. Well, I guess they are going to harvest the planet. Well, come on, you motherfucker. Oh, God. Hello. It wasn't quite expecting that. Shit. That hurts. There we go. Ooh, we got about another blast left, I reckon. Out of ammo. Come on. Recharge. Shit. There we go. Ready to rock. Whoa. And I'll spare you the noise. Another hard lock, guys. So I will be right back. God damn it.
human? Why are you here? I am here to avenge my people. Your people? Were it not for us, your species would never have existed. You were created only to be consumed. What are you saying? Eons ago, your planet was nothing but a barren rock. We seeded your world as we have a thousand others with the beginnings of organic life. Returning to reap our harvest when that life had ripened. We own you. I am a warrior of the Cherokee Nation. Nobody owns me. Cherokee? I do not understand this notion. Your spirit is what separates you from the others. It is why you have been spared. We will add your strength and knowledge to ours. You will become like us. You will become a god. I came here only to kill you. Your skills are formidable. But they are no match for the power of the Keepers. You will fail, and we will harvest your planet. It is over. Right, okay, so we're back again, guys, I hope. You might be able to hear my cat purring. In fact, if I mute the Xbox, you're definitely going to be able to hear my cat purring. As she snuck onto me... Whilst I was sorting out my problems. You little purr beast cloud. Anyway. Let's go kick some reaper ass. But we're going to save it first. Because after the emulator crashed. We did have to. Um, go back through. That whole spiel of his again. Interesting. So the reapers. Or the keepers I should say. They owned, or they seeded the earth like they did a thousand other planets. Interesting. So, I wonder what they do exactly. Like, what is their purpose? They just go around playing God around the entire universe? Or is there something more to them? I guess we'll never find out. But it is quite the interesting uh, idea. I wonder how useful that would actually be. You know, to seed worlds. I suppose if you have like an infinite time. Or you're immortal. I suppose it makes sense. But, I don't know. It just it seems really inefficient to me to do it that way. And why would you create life? with If you're going to harvest it and use it for food. Why would you create such sentient life? Hmm, am I overthinking it again? I'm overthinking it again. Surely you would create cattle or something. Even saying that though, oops, oops, even saying that though, like, even, like, if I was going to create something to literally uh, be used as a food source, it wouldn't have any thoughts, any feelings, you know, anything like that. Because that just seems pointless. You just need a way of keeping the minerals and protein fresh. Oh, hello. Who are you? I guess Jen wasn't the only one to be turned into one of those things. Although I'm guessing Jen was like a more potent version. There we go. You can't actually use whole canisters. Or is this thing going to be just as potent? Ouch, that hurts. We are doing some good damage. Come on, buddy. Unfortunately, there really is no good way of avoiding their attacks. Shit, that hurts. Yeah, see, it's the game's just like auto-switching me to empty weapons. Which I'm not a big fan of, to be honest. Come on. Keep taking my rockets. Holy shit. That thing was tough. 
Not quite as tough as Jen, but tough nonetheless. Okay, let's keep leaning on our rocket launcher here. Still haven't seen the power of the keepers yet. I mean, all you're doing is spawning... Uh-oh. Did I speak too soon? Oh, God. Right, okay, fine. Let's get to work. That's not too bad. Okay, he's not too tough. Your feeble mind. Well, actually, your impressive mind. There's no match for my impressive weapons. Just gotta not get hit. Whoa. Don't get hit. Come on. Come on. Let's just nuke this guy into next week. Now it's over. Fuck you, buddy. No, Darcy. It has just. Look at those begun. things. Right, give me that. Oh, what the fuck now? Uh, where the fuck are we now? Why is there still a health bar on the screen? Hmm. Ooh. Nice. Needed that. We also need supplies because our acid gun is very low. Ooh. Oh fuck! More. Oh keepers. shit! Well, I. Ooh. What the fuck? Okay. Let's get serious with these guys. No more playing around. Ah, shit. So, who's really in charge here? Mother or the keepers? I am confused. Because if you think about it, like, the keepers seeded the race, but the mother seems to be... Oh, God. The mother seems to be actually pulling the strings. Really strange stuff. Now I'm hoping that these ones, oh god, these ones are just as hard, I think. They're taking up so much damage. Come on, you fuck. Come on. Have my grenades. Is he dead? Yeah, okay. Okay, they're not quite as tough as the other one. The other one must be boss keeper. Whereas these guys, oh god, are just cheap imitations. Lower rank. But they're still bloody hard enough, and we are exhausting everything. Just gonna keep fucking grenading this guy. Fuck you, pal. They look cool, though. Like, their brains are just like big stacks of meat. Really strange stuff. Uh, let's recharge our leech gun. If we can actually find something to charge the leech gun up with. Oh, look at this. We've got that high energy stuff. That's what we want. Nice. She's like a hot knife through butter. Ah. More coffee was needed. Right. Let's continue. So, yeah, I guess, like, I don't know. Still not 100% sure what's going on with the hierarchy of this place. Give me ammo. Sounds like we've got more of them through there as well. I would expect nothing less. Hey, buddy. I've got some searing death for you right here. See how powerful this weapon actually is. Now we've got something we can gauge it against. And what are all these eggs? Ooh, I wonder if these eggs are like keeper eggs. Do they come from eggs? We may never know. I'm guessing... Oh, God, there's multiple... Multiple keepers. And it... Yeah, this thing does so much damage. I'm not sure either. Ooh, that backfired on you. Why, we've still got that bloody um, health bar on the screen. It's a little bit weird. Nice, we got the lightning back. Cool. Give me more acid. I do like the acid. Yeah, it seems like they've gone for the biological control as well, whereas you would have thought like creatures this advanced would have gone for like the molecular control. Like, they should be able to control the very molecules of, of the fabric of the universe. Which I believe is where we'll eventually head. 
as long as we don't exterminate ourselves, you know. Cloud, are you really, you, you're purring so loud. You're actually being a little bit off-putting now. In a cute kind of way. Come on. How many of these keepers can we kill? Shit. Getting really hurt here. Give me some more of that. Give me some of that sweet, sweet pap. Come on. Nice try, buddy. Nice try. Probably a good idea to try and shoot those down. Come on. Yes. Fried your fucking ass. All right. Oh, I thought there was going to be another one then. I was like, what? Why you do this? You're like lambs to the slaughter. Bow before me. Okay, cool. So, we can come down here, but why? There's nothing here. Ah, or is there? That's, is that the way we came? Possibly. Yeah, these keepers, regardless of whether they're actually in control or not, they definitely seem to be high up the food chain. So I guess we are going this way. I thought this was the way we came. Ooh, more ammo. Oh shit. Gimme. More keepers? But of course. What else? Come on, daddy. Let's do this. Yeah, this lightning gun is pretty good. Very hard to hit him, though. We're fucked as well. We need health. Oh, shit. Hopefully it'll recharge. I don't think you can hurt them when they've got that shield shit going on. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, God. Hey, was he about to throw the body of his friend at me? That's quite cute, in a way. That's very cute. Oh, he's going to throw the body of his friend at me. Oh. I guess there's no love lost between these guys. Ooh. Yeah, each blast from that lightning cannon feels so powerful. Although not necessarily against these guys. Wait, there's more. Fuck. Alright, give me some more. Yes. I do like this stuff. Right, melt. And melt your ass down, boy. There he is. Come on. Oh, God, there's two of them. You don't need those shields, guys. You don't need those shields, surely. Shit, he's escaping. Why you escape? Stay and fight. See, humans, we love war. We were built and born for war. Probably enjoy it too much. Whereas you aliens are kind of sucky, to be honest. All this power, and you can't stop one immortal Cherokee. Pathetic. Give me that. Alrighty, give me some of that stuff. I suppose it would be hard to defeat an immortal enemy, but uh, maybe you shouldn't make enemies of immortal things. Just saying. Or maybe if you are going to create uh, some kind of sentient food, don't make it superior. Where do you think you are going? Coming for you, I guess. We're not done yet. Let's get the slud shotgun out again. Ooh, hello. Oh, no. Don't really want to fight these guys in this sort of close range. Alright, where have you gone, you little bitch? Damn it. Missed. Ooh. Yeah, that acid doesn't feel as powerful as it should. The acid canister, I should say. But then these are like the top tier enemies. Hey, guys. Have you missed me? I've missed you. I've missed how easy it is to kill you. Oh, God. And you. Hey, buddy. Because it, and there's no mention of the keeper. Everything says we're keeping the protein for mother. Oh, hello. 
Poor decision, mate. Poor decision. Ow. I think a lot of this is actually missing, but that's fine. It's like a huge flamethrower. Oh, there's plenty left in us yet, love. Don't you worry about that. Anyway, we have perished several hundred times, but we just keep coming back. Because we're a closet badass. Oh, this looks juicy. You can send as many fucking freaks as you want. It's you I'm after. Oh, fuck. I could command these keepers to slaughter you in an instant. Could you now? Bullshit. Your life rests in my hands. As it has since you arrived here. Really? But instead, I offer you their lives. As a sign of my faith in you. I guess she calls the shots. Come to me now. Come and take the place I have prepared for you. All right. This is All it. All right. Oh, I guess this is uh, time to go make her pay for her sins. Shit, she's just like nuked all of the keepers. Well, I don't know if that's all of them, but a good chunk of them anyway. Let's go. Here we are, guys. Mother's Embrace. Mmm, let's go have a little word with Mother. See what's been going on around these parts. Mmm. <sighs> Lovely. Ooh. Hello. Really? For thousands of years, you say? Curious. Ooh. Ooh, this one's different. What the hell? Ooh. Hang on. i got to try and remember what we do here. Right, so we can open them up, I think. Right, when they're like that. Okay. Uh, damn you, woman, and your puzzles and shit. I think we charge in. I thought we had to, like, grab them or something, but maybe not. So we're not the only ones, then, that have made it this far. It's just been a couple of years, you know, a couple of thousand or whatever. Do we have to get closer? Yeah, we do. Okay. How's that feel, Mother? Are you getting roasted? Although, she's kind of expecting us to do this, I think. This is how we're opening her little cube. There we go. At least I hope we're doing the right thing here. We were doing something. There we go. Another one down. Let's have a little look inside this weird sphere. That's like some kind of birthing chamber or something. This game has been pretty gribbly with that kind of stuff so far. Okay. Shit. Missed. Is there like a time limit? Are some of these like cooling off? I hope not. Come on. Ah, just out of range. Very deceptive the range on this thing. There we go, another one down. Okay, I think possibly that's the last one. Nope, there's one left after this. Come on, you fucker. Open up. So annoying the way this thing bounces around. Because you can only zoom off when you're right up against the wall. 
You can't zoom off when you're bouncing around like that. Right, come on. There we go. Damn, out of range again. Come on. There we go. And again. Nice. Now, what about the other ones? Uh, I hope this is good. I think that was good. Ooh. You look human. You. You're human? I was once. I was brought here countless generations ago. Harvested like so many others. Like you, I resisted. Fought the keepers of the sphere all the way to this venture. Mm. The sphere recognized that I was exceptional. It had grown old. Tired. And it offered me a deal. My people would be spared if, if you took over. Yes. To be I see. Or to perish. I made the obvious choice. As you will. I now. don't think so. I think fuck you, bitch. Good thing I remember this. So we have to use spirit power to light up all these spheres. A little bit like that. I think that's all of them. Yep. Then we can shoot through them. Hey, matey! Fuck you. Damn it. Not quite quick enough, I don't think. Right, let's try that again, shall we? Can't exactly remember how to do that. I think there's ah, one left. Oh, okay, yeah. Nope. Come on, stop getting stuck. There we go. Oh, fuck. Don't use that. What have we got here? Yeah, I think we have to hit all of these at once. I think. Shit. Oh, we've got all these fucking bitches taking us over. Fuck you, pal. Enjoy your death. I hope it was painful. Come on. Come on. Can we actually shoot through that yet? No, I see. I see. So these don't actually reset. I got you. Chunked. Nice. Cool. Is she open for attack? No. Fuck. But we are. We're always open for attack. Hmm. Right, well. I kind of respect understand her decision, but was her saving her people worth the lives of trillions of other creatures? I can't answer that. But what we are going to do is make sure it doesn't happen again. Because she's been a very naughty lady. Any more? Yeah, there is more. There is. Oh god, we're almost dead again. Oh man, when when do you get the time to attack her? Like literally. I do remember this bit being a little bit of a pain in the ass. I mean, you know, you you're immortal, so it's not too bad, but it's annoying enough. Yeah, I think these guys are just gonna infinitely spawn. Right, one left. I think. Come on. Is that all of them? Uh, question mark? Oh, yeah, something's happening. Something's happening. Talon, what 
Ooh. Ooh. No! Ah, Talon's killed himself. Sacrificed himself. Ooh, now we're somewhere else. What the hell do you want with me? I see in you what the spare sword in me so long ago. The spirit of the warrior. Ooh. It is that strength that makes you the perfect being to replace you. I didn't come here to replace you. I came here to Fucking right, Tommy. Do not waste your time with futile attempts to harm me. Your choice now is clear. Immortality or oblivion. Oblivion sounds good. So be it. Right, let's fuck her up, Tommy. And now you Yeah, well the thing about that, love, is uh I can't die, so you know. Now I can't remember how to do this. I know she's invincible, like this, but I th think something to do with those. Yeah, I think we've got to hit those when she's close to him, which, if memory serves, is much easier said than done. Okay, let's go and unleash all of these. Yeah, laugh it up, bitch. Laugh it the fuck up. There we go. There we go. Nice. Yeah, she's not actually that resilient. What's so funny? You're going to get spanked. Honestly. Ouch. Ouch. Even if you kill me, bitch, I'm just coming back. Like, there's no stopping me. Your fate was sealed the second you killed Jen. I'm sorry, but that's just the way it is. You know? And you're just a useless old bitch. And you're gonna get... What's coming to you? Sorry if this upsets you. Or even worse, sorry if this is a surprise to you. Did that hit her? No. Yeah, sure it might take me a while to whistle you down. Might take me a long ass while to whittle you down. But whittle you down, I will. Because I have unlimited tries at this. And unlimited is a lot. Come on. Go sit next to my big boomy thing. Did he get you? God damn it, bitch! You slippery little turd. Right, there we go. Right, good, good, good. Oh, she is quick. She is quick. She's also been on the old laughing gas. By the sounds of things. Like, she is finding something hysterically funny. Maybe she's just gone mad with a thousand years of life. I'd probably do that to you, to be fair. This video's gonna overrun, I think, but... Ah, oh, it just seems like a pain in the ass to stop it now. But we might have to, because there is a little bit of this left. Not huge amounts. Damn it. She hit the button. But... No, she's gone now. Go stand next to that, love. Go on. Go stand next to my mine. Damn it. Finicky aiming. Right. Yeah, I don't think having a longer video is going to be too much of a problem. Where is she? Compared to that mine. Nowhere near it. Ooh. Come on. Oh, you fucking... There we go. There we go. Nice. Let's switch up something more potent. Yeah. Oh, shit. So we can only hit her once with that. Hmm. I don't know what's worth it. Probably just better off sticking to this. Yes, 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 yes. Laugh it up, bitch. Okay. I really don't know what you're finding so funny about this. The fact that you're getting your ass kicked by a human. She's almost half dead, to be fair. But as you can see, she has gone quite mad. Not quite mad with power, though. Go on, love. Go next to that mine. That mine's uh, got the cure for what ails you. Or that mine. Either or. Yes. Ha 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 ha. Bitch. Fuck you. Wow. 
That really didn't last. Maybe the effect... Maybe the shield goes down. Like, the closer she is to the explosion, maybe? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Pain, pain. Macho Herto. I don't know if that's... Actually accurate. Shit. She's in a perfect position there as well. <sighs> Fuck. There we go. Nice! Fuck you, bitch. Taste my fusion. She don't like it. Not at all. Too much fusion for this woman. Alright, yoink, yoink, yoink. Maybe the auto cannon might be good against her, actually. Maybe. We do have a little bit of auto cannon left. We don't have any mines in the air. Which is the problem. Suck my mine. Uh oh, ouch, 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 ouch. Me no lucky. Okay, you've made your point, love. You've made your point. I'm sorry, what point was that again? I forgot. I've got a short memory. Oh, that one. Okay. Come on. There we go. Mine up in the air. You're about to get mined, bitch. Ooh, not quite. Not quite. Oh, you cow. Stop getting away from my mines, honestly. I need them. You have to understand. I need these mines to kill you. Okay. There we go. Kind of like that. Yeah, that's not... That's not bad against her, actually. Seems more efficient. Alright, one more mine and she's fucked. And not the good kind of fucked. I mean the proper fucked. Ooh, that came down to the wire then. <gasps> no way. Ooh. Ooh. Just. Couldn't let you go on like this. Destroying entire civilizations. It had to end. This earth is a civilization unto itself. A living. Yeah, but it's not worth it. To destroy it would be no less a crime. The sphere is yep. a parasite. It must be destroyed. Listen to me, Demosito. My time in this world is finished. Once I'm gone, you must bond with the sphere. Oh, I don't think so. You cannot imagine the power you will gain. With great power comes great responsibility. Ooh, fuck. Well, I guess we're in the sphere now. All this knowledge. Okay. Uh, where's the self-destruct switch? Or is it going to corrupt us? The voice of reason. Such power is an illusion, my grandson. It comes with a terrible price. But I can do great things. I can... Listen to your heart. You know what must be done. Yes, Inisi. I must. Finally listening to Anisi. Destroy this universal parasite. But who built the sphere, though? So many questions. Like, it's obviously mechanical. Flying it straight into the sun. Nice.
grandfather. Am I? No, grandson. It is not yet your time. The sphere? The dark ones? Destroyed. Consumed by the fires of the sun. Nice. The land of the ancients is restored. Your name will forever be held sacred here and in the hearts of all Cherokee. The Aniwudi will never forget what you have done. And there is one who wishes to thank you above huh. all. Jen. Hello, Tommy. Jen, I'm so sorry. Oh, don't be. I'm among my brothers here. The spirit of the Cherokee surrounds this place. It feels like coming home. I only wish you could stay. I can't? Jen's spirit resides here now. But you belong in the living world. When will I see you again? When your time comes, I'll be right here, waiting for you. Until then, we will watch over you. Tommy, it is time. Goodbye, Tommy. You've become a great <laughs> man. Oh, it's such a cool ending. It's so good, but we've got to leave Jen and our grandfather behind. So yeah, there we have it. Pray. What an interesting and really bloody unique game. Really, really good stuff. Yeah, I've actually, that's probably the fourth time in like ten years. Yeah, probably the fourth time in 10 years I've actually finished that game and it still holds up really, really well. I think in hindsight I probably should have done the PC version because the frame rate really does hurt it a little bit. Um, but it's certainly worth playing on the Xbox. And um, it, there's so, so much lore to this as well, even though there's no logs or, or any hidden um, like files to find. It's just such a really interesting universe, like the sphere itself as well. There's so many unanswered questions. Who built the sphere, for instance? Why is it there? What's its purpose? It's just really strange, you know, because it is mechanical. It's some biomechanical creation, and it has like a, you know, uh, electronic interface and everything. So it must have been created. It's so weird. And there's so many weird races as well in the game. Um, oh, it's, yeah, it's really, really sad that this never, never got a true sequel, but never mind. And as I said before, the sequel to this game looked really, really freaking promising. You know, you play as Tommy again as well. Tommy was going to be the main character. And it was going to go in a really different um, direction. Um, but there is something after the credits, I believe, which kind of gives a nice little nod to um, what was coming up next. And then obviously there was the trailer, the E3 presentation that they did. Um, oh, by the way, this game's a work of fiction, so no nightmares, kids. Really, Cloud? Really, Cloud? You keep making me lose my concentration. I mean, that's not hard, to be fair. My concentration is shit at the best of times. But you're not making this easy, are you? You're constantly bothering me. But that's okay, because I love you. Mwah. Even if you are getting old and smelly. Still my little girl. Uh, yeah, I completely lost my train of thought now, thanks to this cat. They love cats. Cats, man. So yeah, I do highly recommend uh, looking up the trailer for the original Prey sequel. Prey 2. So much promise. It was going to be extremely different to this as well. Whereas this was like a straight up shooter. And man, I just wanted more of Tommy. Tommy's such a cool character. And the whole Cherokee stuff as well. Ah, it was. I loved it. With the Native American side of it is so good. Cloud. Now she's getting all clawy. Yeah, I've disturbed. I've disturbed the slumber of the furry one. 
You're gonna sing the song of your people into the microphone. You're gonna become famous, Cloud. Dopey cat. As you notice as well with the uh, play testers, there really wasn't many. Maybe it's easier to uh, bug test a game like this because it's fairly well. It's very linear, I guess. Six months later. Yeah, we're back at the bar. I guess we've repaired it. This is a cool little bit. So yeah, we're rebuilding the whole place. Local news. Reparations continue on the state capitol building. Oklahoma City Mayor Tom Jackson was at the site today, commemorating the anniversary of the still unexplained natural disaster that struck the region six months ago. The state capitol building is a symbol to the great people of Oklahoma representing our indomitable spirit in the face of nature's wrath. Today, we not only restore a building, we restore a community. The White House has yet to issue an official report on the events of six months ago, claiming all findings are sealed pending further mm. investigation. Next on Science Week, special guest Professor Greta Caldwell from Normal State University will discuss her theories connecting solar flare activity in recent months with mm. the... Solar activities, eh? And we've still got our trusty wrench that we're now using for construction instead of eh, eh, deconstruction. Oh, are you still open? Hello. Greetings, Tommy. I thought you were dead. How did you escape? The portal we built worked, but not the way we expected. I was rescued by powerful mm. beings. They've taken notice of you and have sent me to find you. What are you talking about? No one knows what I did up there. Not on this world, no, but. Your actions are well known elsewhere. These beings are very anxious to meet the great Domasi Taudi. Let me introduce you. Come. Mmm. How freaking cool is this? Seriously. Uh, let's just take like one last look around. Pocket some cash and then get out of here. Alright, Eloise. Uh, can I take the TV? Is there like TVs where we're going? It's not very good TV, but... Alright, let's go. And there we go, guys. Oh, God. Ha they set that up so well. Prey will continue, but it won't. That's the thing. It won't. And now they've poisoned it with the new Prey, which, again, was very good. But it wasn't this. So... In uh, in what was supposed to be Prey 2, from what I remember. I'm actually going to watch the trailer uh, now. The original Prey 2, you're supposed to come like an intergalactic bounty hunter. Working for these, um, these, these mysterious higher powered aliens. And they showed like footage of the alien worlds you went to and stuff. And it, oh man, it has so much promise. So unfair. I know, life's unfair, right? Never mind. Anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap this up here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. I know I have. And as always, till next time.